PXPM, there's lack of automation in there. There are things that you would like it to do. It's not doing. Um, one of the features we have not seen a lot of accounting practices using within XPM. So we will talk about milestones today. Welcome everyone to Future Proof Accountants, where we talk all about systems, processes, and technology for our accounting practices to make our lives easier. With milestones, Milestones has been within XPM or Green Zero, whatever you call it, for a very long time. There's one way of using milestones where you can go to each job, create milestones, but that's very manual. Or you could do a smarter way and create it within the job template. So every time a job gets created using that template, the milestone gets created as well. So I'll share my screen now with you all. Go to settings in XPM and click on job settings where there are job templates. We will go on to job templates now and see we've got all these job templates right there. So you could create a new one or let's just work with the existing one in the activity statement. See how we've got these milestones already set up. These are probably the ones that I've tested. So the benefit of this is every time there is a new job created for activity statement, so the, the, what is already there, it means that after three days, um, there will be a milestone within the dashboard of your team member, follow up with the clients for documents. After three weeks, there will be another follow up. These are not going to go to the clients. These will sit on the dashboard of your staff members. So they are reminded that this is what they have to do lodging of GSC statement. So if you create activity statement jobs in your practice on uh, say, you know, 30 or the, on the last day or the first day of the month, it's going to say, you know, your milestone for this pass is, is within three months. So when you create these milestones, you can just come here, go new milestone. And let's just say you, um, you know, call client, re eight year payment or and then you can decide, okay, I want to talk to them one month after the job start. It is obviously um, not super automated because the only thing you have got to play with is the job start. But job start is the date that you can change according to your needs. So highly, highly recommend using milestones if you're not already using it. It will make your life easy. It will ensure your staff has the information. Or if you are a team member, you know, get your boss or manager or practice manager onto milestones, which will make your life easy. You'll be able to see all your milestones and your work plan on the dashboard. Thank you very much. And I will see you next time. Bye bye. Let's stay in touch. Follow us at futureproofaccountants.com.au.